Time to talk weather on a night when uh, sometimes the sky was electric and a little bit loud, and then other times uh, it was a gully washer in yeah, some spots. Yeah, it was. Huh? A little scary out there on the roads tonight, David. Yeah, uh, toad strangler, gully washer, <laughs> what else do you like? Yeah. Uh, goat floater, I think we yes, have also. Yes, that's yeah. the one. <laughs> uh, big time rain today. Take a look. I, I kind of try to find and highlight some of the higher amounts, but a lot of folks had more than an inch of rain. I think the winter, winter chicken dinner, eastern Polk County, where we had more than two inches of rain falling, and uh, that even prompted an aerial flood advisory briefly for Polk County. Uh, things are calming down a little bit, but I say a little bit. We still have uh, quite a bit of a shower activity out there, even in Polk County. Now, no strong to severe storms like we had earlier uh, moving through, but still some nice, decent rainfall. And we still have a few flashes of lightning that we're dealing with as well. So let's zoom in on it and see who is getting what. Uh, notice Dade Walker County. We're seeing some nice areas of rain and thunderstorm activity, very scattered lifting up from southwest to northeast. Uh, we also see that as we slide northward, had some heavy thunderstorms in Cleveland earlier today. Uh, still a few recent th uh, thunder strikes, but you can see all of that beginning to fall apart. But lifting up toward Athens and Etowah, Athens, Etowah, I think you'll be getting this bulge of rain lifting up into your area within the next 15 minutes. And then really the same areas that saw more than two inches of rain getting even more rain uh, tonight. So our future scan can take this one hour out into the future and you can see again that rain lifting up through Athens over the next hour and these showers lifting up through Walker County into Catoosa County uh, sliding on into Whitfield County and that's going to continue to see some shower activity that's going to be working its way up toward Blue Ridge and Ella J. So on and off through the night tonight we'll continue to see these spotty showers moving through. Right now it's 69 degrees in Chattanooga. Made it to 82 for our high today and sky watchers checking in real quick upper 70s low 80s pretty much across the tennessee valley we'll have a complete weekend forecast i know you have big plans coming up in just a moment guys